tuned. One of the things that I did forget though, y'all, I forgot to show y'all the length of the wig in the front when we got into the video. So I'm gonna do it now so that you can see the length. She is pretty long. This is Brazilian DR31. Check the video out and see how I slayed this unit, okay? What's up guys, it's your girl Chandra Jesse, and I am back with another video and today is Synthetic Slay. So you know how I like to bring it, cheap affordable wigs for my moms who just don't wanna spend a lot of money on hair, okay? You can buy a couple of these, toss them, get rid of them, and keep it pushing, sis, okay? This is a oldie but goodie, one of my favorite uh, from back in the day. It is by, by Altre. It is a quick weave. It is style Brazilian, and I have her in color Dark Root 30 slash 1. So you can get her in all different type of colors. I used to wear this one years and years and years ago. Uh, and I saw it and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and get it again. This is what she looks like. I've taken her out and everything. See, the color is beautiful. Wow. The more I look at this, I'm like, dang, they didn't give me enough of the, the DR30. Like y'all was a little selfish this go round, but let's see what we can do. Um, I already have a little bit of leave out out. I think I may have too much. So I'm going to go ahead and tuck a little bit of this in my wig cap. The synthetic wigs have saved my hair life. I used to get sew ins back in the day all the time, y'all, but I would lose sleep for at least a week trying to um, overcome how tight my braids were. Like I would be in pain and I couldn't keep doing that to myself. So I it just, it hurt too bad for me, but this has definitely saved my hair life. So I have no complaints. She does come with a large comb in the front. She comes with a large comb in the back. This is a little bit smaller than the one that's in the front. And then she comes with adjustable straps as well. So let's prop her on. We're gonna tilt it just a little. See where I got that parted right there. See if we can stick with the same part or if we're going to have to do some adjusting. <clears throat> yes, I'm feeling it. What y'all think? This wig is really lightweight. Um, I remember that from the last time that I wore. I love like the type of curls that it gives. It's more of a curl than a wave uh, to me. It's like a loose curl type of um unit but i love it it is thin it's on the thin side i can't even lie but i do not like a lot of synthetic thick wigs like they don't work for me i prefer thinner wigs versus thicker when i'm doing dealing with synthetic so as you can see i'm basically just trying to get this lined up where it does not look like a wig All right, so what I'm gonna do here is I got my, it's a 10 Miracle Leave-In. This is a heat protectant too. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just going to flat iron my hair. Now, I know a lot of wigs, they say um, you can actually flat iron the synthetic hair, y'all. I have never ever flat ironed a synthetic wig. Um, this one actually does not, yes it does. It says heat resistant fiber high techs um and it says safe up to 400 and 400 degrees uh safe up to 400 y'all it's a no for me i just don't feel putting 15 20 dollars into a wig and trying to flutter that's just my personal opinion i've seen some people slay them you know, if I get a little bit of the hair in when I'm flat ironing my own hair, because what I should have done was flat iron mine first, that's cool. But as far as flat ironing the entire wig, yes yeah, a no for me. to 
curl too tight or do any of that because I'm doing a few wig reviews today, but I definitely just wanted to kind of just give you an idea of how this unit looks. Um, so what I would normally do is just because I'm not curling it that tough, I'm just going to stick that back there. You can tuck that behind the ear or you don't have to. Um, I'm not going to use a brush or anything on it because I'm not going anywhere in this unit, but yeah. So here goes, let me make sure that I adjust that. And remember, I'm not putting bobby pins in my hair, but I would normally always secure it because extra security don't hurt nobody, okay? So anyway, throw a little bit of the DR30 up here. So twist this a little more. I will put a bobby pin right here to secure this. Right, be quiet, girl. Y'all should be all up in the video sometime. <laughs> Even when she don't supposed to be. Get back, because ain't nobody done your hair or nothing. And then we did you would be able to do your video later, back. Okay? Mommy, this a lot. Now, you could take a little bit of edge control. I will at least do that, because I want to give you a full review of this wig, this unit. Put a little bit of edge control there. Make sure you cover up your line because you definitely don't want that showing. You don't want that showing, girl. What Ray right, said? You don't want that showing. Right, Mama? Yeah. Do you need any more ponytails for my hair, Kyle? No, baby. Are we doing the one you showed me? Yeah, we're gonna. Well, we gotta do that one later because I gotta wash your hair first, okay? Okay. Now you can curl that a little better. You can, but I was just trying to show you guys what this hair is looking like. <laughs> it is very. It's a lightweight wig, so you could actually wear this in the summer if you're not bothered with it being on your shoulders and everything. <laughs> All right, then I would I would secure that with the bobby pin back there. And um, this is how I would rock this. Bring a little bit more of that to the front. It's the vibe for me. It's the vibe for me. Y'all like it. <laughs> Alrighty, so this is what she looks like. This is the front. Like I said, I'm not rocking her out. If I were, I would probably pull out just a little more hair, but I still don't think it is too noticeable um, that it is a half wig. Um, if I had more hair out, um, I would be able to work with it a little more, but I don't. But I just wanted to bring this oldie but goodie back because I think this is some fire hair for date night. I think this is the front. And this is the back. She's pretty long. I don't want to show my... This Altre Brazilian in color DR30 slash one. Check her out. All right, guys, so I'm gonna get on out of here. Let me know if you like this unit or if you don't, it's cool. But be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you click that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload. And hey, make sure you subscribe to this channel. Like, subscribe, okay? I'll see you guys in the next Synthetic Slay. Bye. <laughs>